Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I have a, another wig review for you guys and this wig is from Wild wow, African. But before I get started, let me just tell you guys that they are having a Black Friday sale right now where you get 20% off the entire website and each customer gets a chance to spin the wheel with the chance to win a free wig. So that's cool. Um, and of course I have a coupon code for you guys. So I have all that information down below along with all of the information on what's in this box. Um, so yeah, let's get started. So what I have for you guys is a 360 wig. So I know a lot of you guys have seen the 360 frontals now and what a 360 frontal is, is basically it's lace. It's kind of like a headband. It goes all the way around the head and a lot of people are making their own wigs out of them where they're just adding um, a cap in, in the middle right here and then sewing or gluing down the actual tracks for the rest of the hair. And what this is, is that is already done for you. So it's not a full lace wig, which you know is like lace all the way through, but it's not a lace front, which is just lace in the front. So this is lace in the front and lace in the back, and then it has wefts sewn in the middle. Um, so it has four inches of lace in the front, so four inches around in the front and then two inches of lace in the back. So it should make it easier for you to put this up in a ponytail and not have to worry about any track showing anywhere around the perimeter. Um, so what we have in the box right now, so they gave a jumbo comb, which I love. These work great for teasing. Um, they also give you, um, I have a nude wig cap right here, uh, a headband of some sort, uh, like a scarf right here. It's actually a lot of stuff in here and a lot of companies are doing this now. They're giving you el elastic. So um, a lot of people, including myself, sew down, uh, not sew down, but they sew elastic inside of their wigs to keep it more secure. So that's awesome that a lot of companies are doing this now. And they also give you a 2017 calendar, which is so cute with the different wig hairstyles and some of your favorite YouTubers are in here. Um, so yeah, let's go ahead and get started. Oh, and of course they give you basically an instruction manual that tells you how to wash and care for your wigs. So, let's see. We'll go ahead and show you guys what the wig looks like inside and out. Um, so I end up getting, let me make sure I'm saying everything right. So I got the, a body wave wig and got it in the natural color i got it in 18 inches uh, 18 inches um the cap construction of course is the 360 lace all the way around it's 180 density also these 360 wigs are a little bit um thicker than the normal or average lace front you know usually they're around 120 or 130 so these are supposed to be 180 and yeah it's definitely really really full um, and it's supposed to have a pre-plucked hairline and the cap is light brown. So again, all the information will be down below. This is what the wig looks like. It is very thick actually. Um, so it has a nice little waves in it. And then this is what it looks like in the inside. So it's actually kind of like a cap. Like usually all of this is not around here. So I'll probably have to turn it inside out to show you guys. Oh my gosh, so it has so many combs in it. Where's the front? Which way is the front? Okay. So this is what it looks like. This is lace. All this is lace all the way around. So it's four inches here and the back is two inches. It also has adjustable straps, still has those. It has one clip in the back. It has one clip on each side and one clip in the middle, but this clip is kind of in the front. So that's a little weird, but yeah. Uh, and the hairline is pre-plucked, but I will probably still pluck it a little bit more. So this is what, I don't know if I can see that, if you guys can see that, but the hairline is kind of pre-plucked. So I'm gonna put this on my head and show you guys what it looks like before I do anything to it. Okay, so this is what it looks like on. I hope this does not take my eyebrows off. Um, but as you can see, this is what it looks like. That's my cap under there but it is slightly pre-plucked. Um, and then the back is like this. So I have a little button right here. If you guys can see that, don't pay any attention. But this is what it looks like on. 
I'm gonna go ahead and I'm going to cut the lace and I'm going to pre-pluck it a little bit more. If you guys want to see a detailed video on how I pre-pluck and customize my lace fronts and my frontals, um, I'll put that video down below. So you and yeah, let's get started. Okay, so the knots aren't bleached. So this is just me showing you a quick way to camouflage the black knots without having to bleach it. So you just spray the inside of your um, wig with some holding spray, then go in with some of your powdered uh, foundation and then just spray it again with the holding spray and then just let it dry. And this does a pretty good job at hiding the knot. Once the holding spray dried, I went ahead and added the elastic band by the ear tabs. And I literally just put this wig on and put it up into a high ponytail. I didn't even use anything, any got to be glue or anything to secure the front of it down. This is literally just holding itself down with the band in the wig. If you want to see how I get my wigs into high ponytails, I'll also put the link to that video down below. And this is what it looks like all down. I'd never really wear my wig in ponytails. Um, so this is the majority of the time how you would see me with my hair down. But the thickness and the texture of this wig is everything. Like I am in love with it. And I think I'm going to start getting my wigs with a thicker density now. And that is it guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to check out the description box below for all the information that you guys may need. I love you guys and I'll see you in my next one.